everybody. Today we have a Patreon from Tim. Tim, you sir have brought us into something we've never heard about. I think mm -hmm. it's the artist performing a song that he collaborated with other artists to come in and perform. That would be Felipe Androli. Thorn, Thorn in our side. side. Yeah, featuring Simon Phillips and Dino Julisic. I can sing. Mm. No, 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 no. Yeah, just full jazz, jazz fusion. They have a really interesting mix. Jazz, fusion, grunge, metal. Dream Theater to me, this, this section, because I'm probably getting the keyboard. song like that jeez wow. man that last gone gone wow i was right jeez interesting man it's interesting band well, or i don't know band. if it's a band right it's a compilation it's, you know? yeah the drummer right you know yeah. felipe and then collaborated with these these yeah it's a collaboration made a, and made it 
They would sound great as a band though, I'm just saying. <laughs> I enjoyed it. It was very groovy, jazzy. Jazz fusion to the fullest. He yes. reminded me of uh, Sean, Sean uh, Reinhardt, I think this is his name, Sean Reinhardt, who mm -hmm. played in Death and Cynic. Mm -hmm. Also, just kind of like jazz fusion kind of type of drummer. And there's two things that stood out to me. I mean, they were all so good. Mm -hmm. But the drummer is phenomenal. He's incredible. That jazz fusion, like that kind of style. And, you know, he's pretty kind of versatile because they do yeah. a lot of like different they stuff did. and a lot of groove in it too at mm -hmm. the same time. And they would drop into jazz fusion and come back and play these groovy sections. And, you know, they're a bit all over the place. That was a thing. Like a lot of times, it like when you're shining so much like as, as, as a band, you kind of have to like have a drop. Mm -hmm. To when it's if you're shining the whole entire time to me, it's like it's gonna lose effect. That was mm -hmm. the only my only thing with this band and, and jazz mm -hmm. fusion bands. I understand are like that. You know, yeah. I'm sure if I listen to the track more, I get it more. But a lot of times when it's going full throttle the whole entire time, you know, it's not it as impactful. Give you a, a breather in between. Well, the, the parts right. that they're playing are not as impactful, even though they are so impactful. They're so crazy. Yeah. But that's my only thing. Everything else, yeah. I mean, and then the the singer was crazy. He's like a uh, phenomenal vocalist. Yeah. The vocalist had like this kind of grungy sound to me. Like during the Alice in Chains kind his... of mixed with a, yeah. a different, during the choruses. Like I can belt like incredible notes and hold them out and have a rough style very and then a very smooth and then time. He down. Yeah. yeah, so he can do both, man. The vocalist was phenomenal and I don't know anything about this band but watching that was pretty crazy they well, were putting on a showcase initially <laughs> um in the first minute or two of the video like his voice went from here to like where he dropped down mm -hmm. and just changed it up so oh mm -hmm. that's and the was type good of versatility up. that yeah, he had absolutely uh -huh. it was interesting too because I felt like they were doing a um kind of throwing in like a grunge rock song into a jazz fusion song. That's what it sounded uh -huh. like to me when I was listening to this. <laughs> like because a mash, they call it? What do they call it? A mashup? A mashup? Mm -hmm. You know, collaboration? I don't know. But they would go on these long jam sections, right? Mm -hmm. Where the, each instrument was having their time to shine. Mm -hmm. That was really cool. Seeing yeah. each band member kind of having too. their time to shine and just jam out for a little bit. But then they would go back to the choruses and some of the rhythms with the vocalist. And then they would go on this, they kept going like back and forth. It's long jam sections coming back. Long jam sections. You know so I was what? like, oh, it sounds like jazz fusion, like a grunge band to me. Like kind of mixed yeah. in there. I might be way off on this, but I got to say it. At a certain point in that song and during the jam sessions, it it clicked with me where I I, I heard um, animals as leaders. Yeah, for, I did. Absolutely. And I'm like, this like, is right right away, maybe you know? this is what animals well, so I think it's a jazz fusion type of band. With like vocals. Oh, that's a good point, yeah. And I'm like, oh, because mm -hmm. it was, he had like that very, that, that, the sound. So Tim, thank you. Thank you for your support. If you guys would like to support us just like Tim, there'll be links posted in the description box of this post mm -hmm. below. Oh!